this is all about Flow Viz Paint. But what is Flow Viz Paint? What use does it have for the drivers and the teams? And why is it used in pre season testing? Well, here at GP Fans, let's tell you all. I'm Ollie Wilson, and let's dive into the reasons behind those peculiar patches on the cars with the Flow Viz Paint. It often looks a bit strange when you see a Formula One car covered in paint as if someone accidentally dropped a bucket over it or a new graffiti artist is prepping the car for the Tate Modern. However, there is a very clear idea behind using flow viz. Now flow in this instance refers to airflow while viz is of course short for visualization, aka flow viz shows the visualization of the airflow. Although the aerodynamics of the car are mainly designed on the computer and with the help of wind tunnels, it's always questionable whether this will work out exactly the same when the cars in reality are put on track. Map airflows. Now this is where the Flowviz paint comes in use. While driving the car, the paint finds its way over the various aerodynamic parts of the car as it hits along the way. This leaves a flow pattern on the car, which clearly shows how the air passes over certain points. This is a great way for teams to find out whether the air currents behave the same in practice as they did in the wind tunnel or on the simulators. The paint is a mixture of dye and oil. Because of that composition, it can easily slide and flow over the car without sticking too much to one place on the vehicle. Bright green is often used because it clearly contrasts with the colour of the car. What the teams often prefer to see is that the paint pattern is rectilinear, so without random or unwieldy shapes. The latter can indicate disturbed air flows or dirty air. So teams will hope that the lines run uninterrupted across the vehicle, because otherwise it could mean that the airflow does not completely run along the aerodynamic parts as designed. Now, if that happens, there is likely to be a loss of downforce, which is obviously not what the drivers want, particularly going through corners. The more paint that is still on the car in certain areas, the more pressure the airflow has exerted on those areas. So it may look kind of cool on the cars, but it actually has a really important purpose for the mechanics and engineers. Flow Viz Paint, I'm sure we will continue to see throughout pre-season testing and over the next few years whenever testing takes place. For everything from pre-season testing, you can get onto gpfans.com and get to GP Fans Global to start telling us your early predictions for the brand new season in Formula One and hit subscribe down below to stick with us here on the YouTube channel as well.